I feel like my phone is just ready for Christmas now. It's so pretty. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another vlog or welcome if you're new. Today is Wednesday and I just got the package that I have been waiting on for literally weeks. My new iPhone 12 Pro finally came in and I am unboxing this in its own video, so stay tuned for that. I don't know if it'll go up before or after this vlog. Um, probably after it. I'm so excited I'm about to film that. Well, this is the aftermath of me setting up my new phone. I just went ahead and filmed the unboxing and oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Here's my old phone. Get your last looks in. It looks so pretty on the back and then the front is all like printed up and nice cracked screen. The new one, so gorgeous. I am so freaking happy. I decided to go with the white and this is 256 gigabytes, just the regular iPhone 12 Pro. I didn't want to do the max, which I already told you guys because I felt like the screen was just huge and it would be kind of difficult for me to hold in one hand. And I really like how easy this one is to hold. It's so beautiful. Well, I am in the car now, obviously, and hopefully the audio quality is not too terrible. But I made the spontaneous decision to go to the Apple store to buy the silicone iPhone case and like the product red because I saw some photos online and it looks so pretty with the white iPhone because it's just like all red, it's like Christmassy. So I ordered it online and I'm going to pick it up. I was gonna order it on Amazon, but it said it wouldn't be here until Friday and I'm leaving Friday and I don't know if it would come before I left. So I just decided to go get it at the Apple store, but I bought it online and they give you like a pickup window so you have to go during that time to like pick up your online order. And I was not paying attention to the time while I was filming that unboxing video. And then all of a sudden I was like, oh my God, I need to leave like now. It's Christmas time. Well guys, I got the new case. It looks so pretty. I'm gonna put it on now. It's so pretty, terrible lighting pop off this clear one. I actually really like this little clear one that I just got from Amazon. I'll link it. Um, but I know I'm gonna like this one better because I did get the MagSafe charger and this will make it so that it connects. I feel like my phone is just ready for Christmas now. It's so pretty. Well, while I am out, I am gonna stop at the AT&T store and have one of those glass screen protectors put on my phone because as you guys saw, if you watched my other vlog, I literally cracked the whole screen on my other one and the screen protector saved it because it was one of those glass ones. So I'm gonna go get one of those put on so I don't ruin my screen and then I'm going to go to TJ Maxx so that I can exchange out this broken Christmas vase thing that I bought when I was with Alyssa and the lady broke. Hopefully they don't give me a hard time about it. Okay, I swapped out the vase thing and it was kind of awkward because the girl that rang me up was the same girl who broke it, literally. And I just told her, like I was nice about it. I was just like, hey, like I was here on Sunday and I actually remember you were the one that checked me out uh, and you dropped it. And just like maybe she would remember, but uh, she was kind of rude after that. But anyway, I switched it out, <laughs> so that's good. And now I'm about to run into the AT&T store and the Starbucks is right next to it, so I'm gonna grab a coffee as well. So I'm back home now and I went ahead and got the screen protector put on and you can literally not even tell that it's there. Super flawless, he did a perfect job. As he was doing it, he was telling me like that he's really OCD about this and so he likes to take his time and I was like, by all means because that's why I don't like putting those on myself because if it's like a little bit off, it will drive me crazy. I also picked up a coffee and this time I got extra chestnut praline. Last time I ordered this, they completely forgot it. Um, but yeah, it's delicious. Well, I got the third little vase. So here's what that looks like with the other ones. It was originally a little bit smaller than this. It was supposed to be like the red one, then this one, and then a little gold one, but they didn't have any more of that size. Would have liked it to be a little smaller, but. It's cute. Well, it's much later now, 6.30 to be exact, and I thought I would show you guys what I did to my iPhone screen. This took me like two hours, no joke, um, and I only did the first page, so the second page isn't as pretty because I'm actually a little annoyed. So I love how this turned out, it's so pretty, but anytime you wanna open an app, first it redirects to shortcuts and then it opens the app. So it kind of slows things down if you wanna do this to your phone. See how it like open shortcuts and then it opens this. But here's all my little shortcuts. Seriously took forever, but 
It looks really pretty. Hello guys, it is now Thursday and I am packing up all of the orders that came in yesterday. So that's what I've been working on for like the last hour and I have 12 more to go and then we're done. <laughs> this is the greatest day of my life. He's so happy because he keeps- I'm old Greg. Because he keeps saying weird things and I'm tired of hearing it. It's just amazing. You ever drink him. Bailey's out of a shoe? What are you talking about? I'm so confused. I'm confusion. Yeah, haven't you seen the video? I don't know. He's quoting some weird video. Some of them might know. Somebody from the station showed him last night. Whatever it is, it sounds It's an old video. Really. Some of them might know it. Really weird. Well, I just took the packages to the post office and now it's pouring down rain. Sitting here with Chad watching The Office, taking a little break. Actually, I think I'm like pretty much done for the day. I have to pack, so I'll do a little pack with me part of this vlog. Uh, Cause tomorrow I'm going to the other coast for the weekend, eating these nacho chipotle chips. They're so good. They're by the late July brand. Chad and I love them. So jealous of your boobs. Thank you. Well, it is now 5.32 and I just went ahead and reset my old phone because I have to send it back in. And I just went ahead and reconnected my Apple Watch to my new phone because I went all day today and yesterday without doing that. So every notification was still coming in through my old phone. I'm in the car again with Chad and we just got out of Target. My camera will not focus on me because it's so dark. Um, but we are heading to Payway to pick up dinner. We were going to cook tonight, and um, we obviously didn't, and we're not. <laughs> and we were also going to go to the gym. That also didn't happen. Honestly, not even mad about that, though. I really just didn't feel like going. I'm going to go in the morning, though, for sure. I've also been really slacking waist training, which I know someone's going to ask me about how that's going, but I honestly have not used a waist trainer in, like, four days. We are back home, and we got... Payway for dinner, and oh my gosh. I got the Kung Pao chicken, and I still the rice for noodles. Good morning, guys. It's the next day now, and I actually just finished packing. Completely forgot that I was gonna do like a pack with me video. I've never actually done one of those, um, but I will show you guys how I organized my suitcase. But it is almost time for me to head out and get on the road. I have to drive across Alligator Alley, and if you live in Florida, you know how that is. Packed up some more orders this morning, so I'm gonna take those to the post office before I head out. So here is my suitcase that is packed like I would be going somewhere for a week, even though it's literally two nights, but this is how I roll. I did use these packing cubes and then my old pink ones as well. Um, and I kind of planned some of my nicer outfits in a cube, so like this is one outfit that I planned out. Um, some more clothes down there and lots of stuff and then flip this thing over, I'm gonna zip this up. And then in here I've just got bras, socks, underwear. And over here, my makeup is in here. And then my Doc Martens, which literally take up so much room in this bag. And this is my little toiletry bag, toothbrush, toothpaste, all that stuff, deodorant. And then over here, I've just got like extra pants, and sweatshirts and jeans and stuff for my sister because she always likes to borrow my clothes whenever we go somewhere together. This is my heating pad because I always take that with me when I travel because I get belly aches, not gonna lie. And then in here is my curling iron and hair straightener and heat protectant and dry shampoo and all of that. Um, some comfy clothes to sleep in. And then over here in my Vera Bradley weekender bag, I just brought my jacket, my eyeglasses, and then in this bag I have my medicine and what else? Oh yeah, this thing is like so helpful. So I have to do my quarterly business taxes and my sister helps me with that. She's like a math genius. So we're gonna do those at the hotel when I get there. So I just brought some paper to do the math on and then obviously my files for that. And then back here, I have this little compartment with my laptop and my iPad and nothing down there. 
And then, oh yeah, I think I have something in here too. And then in here I have chargers. So, that is everything. And then I'm bringing my little Prada shoulder bag and then my Neverfull. And I'm ready to go load this up now. But I am going to go ahead and end this vlog here because I'm about to head out. And I don't know if I'm going to end up vlogging this weekend. I'm going to bring my camera with me. But if I do, it's likely going to be like just little chunks here and there because... I don't plan on like filming the entire thing. Um, trying to live in the moment. So thank you guys so much for watching this vlog. If you're not already subscribed, be sure to click that subscribe button and I'll see you in my next video.